Good morning and welcome back to the channel once again. Uh, this morning you find myself and John returned back to the flower mill or the discotheque or nightclub, however you want to call it. We thought what we'd do, we'd come back because obviously we had a lot of communications before from something dark and some devil dogs. And they said they existed up here in this attic area. So we're here. We're going to spend a little bit of time up on this section, see if we can bring it out. And then I think what we'll do, we'll drop down to the lower nightclub this evening and do some communications in there also. So please enjoy. I'll speak to you shortly. All I ever wanted was you, but you left me alone inside these empty broken walls. And I can't see it clearly, but it's obvious I know. Dark magic, was it magnetic? Was there dark magic here? Is that why you've been, or someone's been stringing up pigeons? Have they been trying to draw something in? Date and time. It's currently the, is it the 13th of, 13th of January, 2024. And the time spirit, I believe, is 25 past one. 25 past one in the morning. Is that okay? Do not touch. Do not touch. I'm not touching anything. There's nothing here to touch, spirit, apart from everything full of pigeon poo. Come and show yourself, please. I'm sure you can show yourself in that passageway. I don't like being up here because we're so close to the front. Take you. No, thank you. Who fell? Did someone fall from one of these windows? I love you. Oh, I love you. Thank you. <laughs> Take it, you're talking about me. No, they definitely talk about me, John. No, they talk about me. Did they? they I had that a lot. Was it? Oh, no, it was on the island, wasn't it? When I, I love you a lot. Yeah. Yeah. So something loves me, John. Something loves me. Well, of course. Right. I'm just wondering where to move downstairs now. I'm just a bit worried about staying up here too long. I've just had you all die. That was nice, wasn't it? Haunt room, that just said. That's what we want you to do. We want you to haunt this place. So please come and do it. Yes, it is abandoned. It's a bloody mess, isn't it? Let's just, I'm just going to have a look through here, John. Where the uh, cellar is. Well, it looks like a cellar. Follow, Follow you. More than happy to. Right hand. right hand. Where are you so we can follow you? You will go. 
So where's the cellar? Through here, John. Yeah. This way? Yeah. We will go. We will go. Oh yeah, didn't see these other stairs, did we? No, zero. Where? Help speak. Help speak? Yeah, we went up them stairs last time. We've got devices with us that'll help you speak. I should have left the spirit box going. Rest in peace. Rest in peace. It appears we found a cellar this time, didn't know we had. You right there, John? Yeah. Old mine. Old mine? What this was? Is it a mess? Well, no, it's not a mess, it's just it's, it's like a steps missing. So the river You're lost. You're lost. No, I'm not lost, Spirit. We know exactly where we are. Hey? Yeah. Dismay. Jesus. What have we got? Leave this place. Oh God, that there's a foot of water down here. Is there? Yeah, yeah, I can't go through that. There's other rooms down here, but it's a foot of bloody water. You like music? Is that why you're at a nightclub? Spirit, can you show yourself in that cellar door? Can you call out to me? I can't come to you because it's full of water. It's because we've got the river close by. Well, it runs next to the house. Get it now. And there's a pump here. That's obviously a water pump to keep the place dry. But yeah, I'm not going to go through that. I, I, if I had wellies, I'd go through, but I'm not getting soaked. Answer. Did they answer me? That's a shame. Yeah. Strangled. Strangled? Who was? The spirit, you said, I'm going to die. Why did you say that, please? It's a bit nasty of you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. EVP. <laughs> yeah, I've got the EVP going. That's what you're responding to. What you're communicating with. Sent. Sent. Spike. Did you? Yeah. I didn't bring the EMF, I should have brought it with me. Walk up. Walk up. Knocking on the wall. Who's knocking on the wall? I'm knocking on the wall now, spirit. Can you copy me? Can you copy me? Show yourself in that doorway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want me, do you? I don't blame you. I'm gorgeous. Control. What's that, John? I said that's not what she said. <laughs> it said oh, that, tell, tell. then it said control. Yeah, you're not controlling He's me. Basement. He's in the basement. We're in the... No, he's in the back seat, that said, John. Yeah. See the back seat of my car? Spirit? Worry. 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 No, I'm not worried. I don't worry, Spirit. I'm not scared of you. You were speaking. You were speaking, was you? I've got the static camera there. Sorry about the light flooding there. But I've got that just filming the area. You will kill, will you? That was a bit nasty of you. What we got there, Joe? Just in the fire exit. Next to the river, isn't it? Stranded. Stranded. No, we're not stranded, spirit. We Far can. From it, we know where to get out. Yeah, we can get out. Envy. Envy? What are you doing envy of? Because we're alive and you're dead. The 
The number one. The number one. Oh, someone lost their Rim life here. Ribbon pod. <laughs> He's at the front door. He's at the front door. Who is? Don't tell me we've got the police here or security again. Michael. Michael. <laughs> Just said my name, Michael. Not sure you can see that. So you know my name, do you, Spirit? Do you know the gentleman's name that's with me? Nowhere to go, Michael. Nowhere to go. Got plenty of places to go, Spirit. Please give open, it. It. open it. Give me the gentleman's name that's standing next to me. Go away now. Nasty gits, isn't they? Yeah. Oh. Obviously this evening we're going to try the new Estes method. Hopefully, because we do must know... Return. Must return. Well, we're going to bloody return oh. again. This is the second time. Yeah, we did return. We have returned. Charles. Is this a portal? Did they say portal? No, I said, is this a portal? Oh, I had closed portal. Phantom. Phantom? Is there a phantom here? Can you show yourself if there is? Is there anything here that can show itself, please? The number eight. eight. Whatever's here, whatever's on the upper floors, please come forward and show yourself to us. Dream. Dream. Traumatic. Traumatic. At the end. At the end. Mason. Mason. Stirs. Stir then. Jesus, this was a big oh, wait, 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 wait. toilet. Why are all these bags full of pillars? Too many. There is too many, isn't there? Female. Female. Yes, these are female toilets, aren't they? Can you tell me why all these pillars are here, Spirit, please? Are the sheets? Yes, yes, yes. Yes, you can, thank you. So tell me, why were they here? Can you show yourself in this mirror, oh. maybe? Hello? Show yourself to me. Come on. Come and show yourself. Come and talk to me. Gerald. Gerald. Something there then. Very odd, that's full of pillars. <coughs> Negative. Negative. She was killed. <coughs> She was killed, was she? John? Yeah. Are you there? There's some old, massive old toilets in the back there. Yeah. Need to stay. Stay, stay, stay. stay right here. Here, here, here. Stay right here. We are. We're not going anywhere, Spirit. We have spoke before. Have we? We have been before. I think we'll take a break in a minute, John, then we'll... Uh, do a nice SS session. Do you reckon? Yeah. I've got an image here. It's, a, it's like a bloke standing in, in a street with an umbrella. 
Oh, there's the first image. A gentleman standing in the street with an umbrella. Spirit, does that mean anything to you? Well, clearly it means something to you because you displayed the image. Can you tell me what it means to you, please? You can show John an image as well as speak through his spirit box. So we have two ways of communicating with you. So I'd appreciate everything that you could do for us. So come into this space and speak with us, please. Come forward and show yourself to me. We're down in the depths of the mill now. We're more in the cellar space. So I'd welcome any visit from you. Can you show yourself in this door maybe? John, John's got another image. Bust a blood vessel? Biggest blank, but bald head. Okay. Do we have a gentleman here with a bald head? Can you come and show yourself to us? Very cold this evening. Temperatures drop quite rapidly. Come on, spirit. Come and show yourself in person to me. Dangerous. What's dangerous? What's dangerous, spirit? Cat ball. Can you see it? John's still playing around with his bit. I'm just going to move this spirit box away. Come on, spirit. Oh, can you see that cable going off now? And that one went off over there as well. Thank you, spirit. Is there something here with me? Please? Is there something here with me now? Electric. Electric? Come on, where are you? Are you in here? Maybe. I won't be gone too long. But John moans when I leave him on his own. It's a lift. Which we can see up there. I don't think I'll stand in there just in case it collapses. Is there anyone here with me, Spirit? Could you show yourself? Where's this demonic entity that was here last time with us? Where are you? Can you hear that water? Ship. Ship. <laughs> Is that because you heard the water flowing? Oh, 
is this? Let's get back to John. I've left him on his own. Yes, it's me. Yes, it's you. I don't know if he's picking something up, but I've got nothing recording there. Poor old John. A man here. There's a man here, is there? Sorry about that, there was a place that I've never been. Let's drop the camera down. Two boats. Two boats. It looks like it's stranded on sand. Be cautious. I've just had be cautious. John's had two boats. While I was outside a little bit there, it said ship, obviously when it heard water. I don't know whether the river's big enough out there to actually take boats. I haven't actually seen it in daylight before. Okay, Spirit, come and now communicate. We're both together now. We'd like to know a little about yourself, if we could. When we done the other club on the second level last time, we found that there were some good spirits there. And they were hiding from the demonic entities on the upper floors. That sounded like he said stop. Said stop. Now we're not going to stop. I need to now communicate with either the good spirits on the next level or the demonic entities on the upper floors. So whichever one's here first, speak with me please. I just said young man. Young man. Is there a young man here? You clearly may have been talking about myself, obviously not John. Come on spirit, show yourself near us. Come and move one of these devices. Come and show John an image of yourself. I've got, I've got music in my ears. We were in a nightclub. What sort of music is it? Can you tell me, Spirit, what music are you playing to John? Please? Please go. Why do you want us to leave, Spirit? We're here with much love. We're not here to mock you in any way. We're here to understand why you're here. Why do you still inhabit this place. Was you here when it was the old mill many years ago? Or was you closer in time when it was the club days? Please Spirit, we've been here long The noise enough. was him. The noise was him? What noise was there Spirit? Did I miss it? They just sounded like dead birds. There's many, many dead birds here. All the way up through this building, there's dead birds. I'll affect you. You'll affect me. 
You're more than welcome to. I don't invite you into me, but you can affect me in some way. I will attach. You will attach. No, you're not going to attach yourself to me. I've just told you, haven't I? I don't want you to attach yourself to me. I'm not prepared to take you home with me. But you're more than welcome to affect me. You can't stop me. Oh, I can stop your spirit. I have God on my side. God won't allow you to attach yourself to me. Are you no. here now? Mock. What, are you going to mock me or am I going to mock you? I'm more than happy to mock you. If that's what you want. Image. Image. Alright. I have that. Uh, I don't know, it's a, it's a kind of a, a circle shape. Use camera. Centre red dot. Use camera. Two lines, it looks like it's saying like 25 to 12, but it ain't a clock. Oh. I'll put the image up anyway, you'll see that. So you'll, you'll, you can get it's a It's not view. just me. It's not just you. You're not on your own. How many do we have here, please? You just asked me to take a picture. Or use camera, you said. Many of us. There's many of you, is there? Can you tell me how many of you are here? Please? Temperature's really dropped at the moment. I'm cold. And John just said he's cold. It suddenly dropped a few degrees. I can feel it. It's gone very cold. Is something here with us now? It feels like there's something here. That's really dropped in temperature. That's just said a hedgehog. Hedgehog. <laughs> Can you see John's hedgehog on the shelf over here? If you can approach it and touch it, we've got a device that will sense you. Can you do that for us? Come on. I know you're here because you brought the temperature right the way down. I can feel it on my shoulders now. God, it's freezing. It's like I'm sitting in a freezer. Come on, spirit. Can you affect John, maybe? Mess. Mess. It's a bloody mess in here, isn't it? It's gone very cold, so I definitely know you're here. So now talk to me. That sounded like I said there was people yesterday. There was people yesterday, was there? I believe there was another team here, or there was somebody here recently, in the last few days. I know someone communicated with me yesterday and said that they'd visited here, and it was a creepy place. And yes, they're right, it is a creepy place. But I need you to do more for me. There's running water directly behind this wall that I'm looking at. And water is supposed to be good for energy. A new spirit of energy. So come and do a bit for me please. And my head's spinning now. You said you were going to affect me. Are you affecting my head? Spirit? Nightclub. Nightclub. Yes, we're in a nightclub. You know that, don't you? I would say you're clever, but clearly you're not. You've been here for some time. So you're fully aware that it's a nightclub. Come on, I want more from you. Ooh. Well, that was weird. Felt something touching me then. Don't go back there. Don't go back where, spirit? Where don't you want me to go? Tell me where you don't want me to go. Playing music. Playing music. Where's the music? 
Spirit. John's had music twice now. Come on. You're doing very well. But you need to do a bit more for me, please. I take temperature down. You have taken the temperature down, yes. I hope you don't anymore. It's absolutely freezing in here. I'm going to have to put... Three children here. here. There's three children here, is there? Why is there children here? There shouldn't be any children here. I keep feeling like something's touching me. I keep getting the sensation of touch. The children. The children are touching me, are they? There's something here. I just don't know what it is. Children. EMF meter going off there. If you're here, can you touch the hedgehog? Or one of the devices that are on the shelf? There's three of us. There's three of you. You've already said that there's three children here. If you're children, could you give me your names, please? Could you do that? Could you tell me how many males and how many females you are? Let's start with the girls first. How many girl children are here, please? We won't hurt you. You won't hurt me. I hope you don't. Two. There's two girls. Okay. So that means there's one boy, is that correct? Spirit? Or spirits? Correct. I'm correct, thank you very much. So there's two girls and a boy. I appreciate that. Can I ask please, could you give me your ages maybe? Could you tell me that? Could you tell me how old you are? One at a time, tell me your age please. Or maybe you're all the same age. Are you the same age? Please? Yeah. You are the same age. Okay, thank you very much. Can I ask, are you five? Six? Seven? Eight? Right, image... There's a table, a chair, there's something on the table, and it looks like there's a leaves of a plant. The forest is home. The forest is home. Spirit, we got to the age of eight before I was interrupted by John. Were you nine years old, maybe? I had one eye. You had one eye? <laughs> Who had one eye? The children? Or one of the children? What's touching me, please? I keep getting the sensation of touch on me collarbone. Energy. Energy? Well, it's definitely something touching me, spirit. I would assume you do have energy. I keep feeling something touching me here. Group. Group. Did you hear that then? That sounded freaky when that come through. I just said Johnny. Johnny? I had a growl here then. Who was that that growled? Well, that was freaky. I didn't like that. Is there something growling here? Can you confirm? I hope my microphone picked it up because it was a distant growl around here. Who growled, please? 
Spirit. Sounded like it said dogs. Dogs, there you go. I knew it. Have we got the devil dogs back again? Are the demon dogs here? Above you. They're above me, are they? They were above me last time. That growl was behind me in this back room here, or in these cellar areas. Where's the demon dogs? Tell me, are you lying? Are they really upstairs? Spirit? Tell me where they are. Satanic. Satanic. Well, clearly they're satanic. They're, they're devil dogs. There's two. There's two what? I'm just going to put my jacket on because that is bloody cold. I'm freezing. That temperature's gone right down since we started. Oh! Very cold. Oh. Sorry about that, I just need to... Let me just turn this around. We're making contact. You're making contact? 400. 400? What does 400 mean, spirit? Please? Come and show yourself. I know you're here. And this is where the growl was coming from. Get away. No, I'm coming now. Because I heard the dogs here, or a dog. You growled at me, didn't you? Can you do it now while I'm facing you? Spirit? Come on. I know you're here. That was either Bert or Hurt. Someone's watching. Someone's watching, I thought so. Who's watching me, please? See you. you see me, do you? Where am I standing if you see me? Curtain. Curtain? Can you show yourself in the corridor? I keep being drawn back to this corridor. I've just got a strange feeling that something exists here. Here. Here, yes. Do you exist here? I heard the growl from here. Are the devil dogs here? Please confirm with John or... Can you help? I can help you. What do you need help with, Spirit? Please. What do you want me to help you with? Oh, I'm glad I put my jacket on. You need to run. No, we're not going to run. Well, my back's starting to give me pain, and that always gives me the indication that we've got something with us. John's putting his hat on. It's unbelievable how much the temperature's dropped since we've been here. Image. Well, how it looks, it looks like a priest. He's got, it looks like he's got a dog collar on. A priest? Are you here to bless us? But he's got, like, white eyes. White eyes? Oh, God, no. And it looks like he's standing by a street light. It disguises itself. It disguises itself, exactly. So it's not a priest, is it? If it's got white eyes, it's not a priest. And you've just confirmed that you're disguising yourself. So you're pretending to be something good, aren't you? And you're not. You're something nasty, aren't you? Spirit. Might be. No, there's no might be about it. You're a nasty we piece are of family. Work. Yeah, we're not family. I don't know who you are, but we're not family. The EMF meat was going off then. Dark energy everywhere. Dark energy everywhere. Yeah, we know. We feel it. 
We feel it all around now. Evil is around. <laughs> Evil is around. And I've just had dark energy everywhere. Thank you for confirming, but we're aware that there's evil around us. You must leave. We must leave. I don't think so. You can sod right off. Toys. Toys. There's many toys here. You can call them toys if you wish. Have we got the nasty little presences back again, have we? Have we got the evil shits back here? Come on then, you piece of crap. If you want to be hurtful to us. If, if me talking this way to you draws you forward, then I'm happy to. Tell me, please, where's the demon? Don't annoy. See, they're, they're starting to come up now because they realise that I'm starting to annoy them. I was told last time. I was told that I was told last time to not annoy you, wasn't I? And did I listen last time, Spirit? Did I listen to you? No. No, I didn't, did I? So you can sod right off. Image. Oh. Oh dear. What's some kind of creature. Oh. With. Well, it looks like it's got fur. It's got a tail. But there ain't no dog. It's got two eyes, but there's like one eyes at the front of it and one eyes at the back of it. Are you saying demonic? Well, that's... Obviously, I'll show the image. And its paws have got long fingers. Oh. How weird. Was you showing him an image of yourself? Because you sound very stupid. Image. It's a, it's a room, stone walls, and there's two doorways. There's something in the corner of the room. I can't see what it is. Can't make it out. It's like a box of some kind, but it's high up in the corner. Demonic presence. You're here. I know you are. Come and show yourself, you tosser. I just had some laughing. I bet you did have some laughing, so I just swore with it. Peter. Peter. Not very demonic, Peter, is it? Is that your name, Peter? Peter? Yes. Are you demonic? Are you evil? No. You're not evil. Thank you, Peter. So you're a nice spirit, shall we say. Could we agree to that? Jason. Don't keep giving me names. I'm speaking to Peter at the moment. Peter, are you a good spirit? Sometimes. Sometimes. Thank you. So, Peter, who's the dark presence that's here, please? Black eyes. Black eyes. Well, I'd imagine you think demonic does have black eyes. Peter, are you still listening to me? Image. There's eight kind of symbols. But I can't, well, I, I couldn't tell you what the symbols are, but you'll see them in the image. Okay, I'll put the image up, and if anybody knows what these symbols are, please let me know in the comments if you would. But eight symbols. Peter, are you still here with me? I've been here 200 years. You've been here 200 years, have you? So why are you still here after all that time? Why are you still residing here? Why haven't you moved on? There must be a reason you're still here. That's a very long time to be... Not allowed. What aren't you allowed to do? You're not allowed to leave, Spirit. Are you not allowed to leave? Could you confirm, please? Yes. Yes. So you can confirm that you're not allowed to leave. Can I ask why you're not allowed to leave, please? Could you tell me that all oh, my back's really hurting now? 
<sighs> Could you tell me why you're not allowed to leave? We're watched. You're watched. You said that last time. It is very strange how we get the same communications when we return back to the location. This man's annoying. What man's annoying? Is it the one sitting next to me or are you talking about me? Spirit, am I annoying? Please. You. Me. I thought I'd be annoying to you. I tend to annoy spirits from time to time. I'm not sure why. I'm such a lovely gentleman. Could I ask why I annoy you, please? Your voice. My voice. Gargoyle. Gargoyle. Oh, lovely. So you don't like my voice, spirit? Is that what you're saying? Does my voice affect you? Does annoying. It, it's annoying. Yes, I thought it was. Do I scare you at all, spirit? I just said laughing. You just said laughing. Obviously, I don't scare you, do I? Well, you're a knob. You're a nasty piece of work. Sometimes. Sometimes, yeah, you've already said that. And that's, this is Peter, isn't it? This is Peter, isn't it? Can you confirm? Might be. Might be. It's you, Peter, isn't it? Peter isn't a scary name, spirit. And clearly my voice irritates you. And quite frankly, I don't care, Peter. Hate. Hate. Hate's a strong word. Do you hate me, Peter? Is that what you're saying? You hate me? Confirm you hate me, Peter. Come on. Come on. All of you. You hate all of us. Well, we hate you also. We find you very irritating. We find you very annoying. Don't want you here. I know you don't want me here, but I'm staying here because you don't want me here. And because you don't want me here, I'm going to wind you up. You have no power, Peter, do you? Your peril. My peril. I'm not scared of you, Peter. I have God's light with me. Image. It looks like a woman screaming. A woman screaming? It what? Like she's got a kind of a crown or a tiara on her head. Why is there a woman screaming, Peter? Have you hurt her? Or you just try to scare us off? Because you can't, you know. You're not strong enough for that. If you had power, you'd move on. But you're not. You're stuck here. You've gone quiet. Why have you gone quiet, Peter? Jim. Yeah, we don't don't want another name. I'm talking to this. I'd say gentleman. I'm not sure if that's the right word for him. But we're here. I've just had a a hissing sound. A hissing sound. Mm, you're really getting a bit upset, aren't you? You're not really bothering me at all. I find you quite strange, quite funny, really. I feel sorry for you. I feel sorry for you. Walking here again. I'm not sure what's going on in this basement area down here. But there's definitely movement down here. Okay, we better look at packing things up in a minute. We've been here some time now. We need to start making a move. But 
if it's actually you, Peter, I'd appreciate you talking to us, although you're a little bit hurtful, but we can put up with that. As long as you communicated to us, that's all we ask. So I will we'll leave my love with Enjoy. you. I'll leave God's love with you. So please go in peace and don't attach yourself to me or John. God bless to you. All right, John. Let's hold it there. All right. <coughs> that got cold, didn't it? I'm frozen. I know, so am I. Oh. The temperature dropped suddenly. I tried to put me out on, but how cold I know. I'm here because of me. Well, I was sitting there saying, it feels like it's dropped two degrees. All of a sudden, you said, oh, it's, oh, it's cold. It's, it's like air conditioning oh. blowing on you. My back's going again. Okay, so thank you for joining us for this return visit to the Mill and Nightclub. Uh, there's some certainly something going on towards the end of this one. Certainly the temperature's really dropped and we've got something a little bit nasty coming through. But in any case, please leave a like and leave a comment as usual if you would. Uh, I shall put the images up from John. Obviously there was one with a number of symbols there, so if somebody can identify them and let us know, it'd be much appreciated. Until next week, God bless. I'll see you soon. See you later.